Good evening and uh, welcome to sports where Michael Coleman has a great sit down with a special guest uh, coming up here in a moment. But first, a look at the SFA Lumberjacks where it was alumni night at the sawmill. Jacks needing a win tonight in order to help their cause as March vastly approaches. SFA gets off to a good start when Latrell Giselle gets his first three of the game to fall. Jelani Stone getting the ball at the top of the key here and floats it off of the backboard. That's good for two. Latrell again uh, takes it to the top and gets the jumper. Giselle beginning to feel it as the SFA offense would begin to heat up. Check out Nana who begins to make a highlight tape for himself down below. He gets the pass here, makes a sweet spin move for another basket, and then look out the bounce pass to Nana under the basket who finishes with the two-handed slam. The Caros have no answer for him down below, and that gets these future jacks up and going. They love what they're seeing. Later on, Hamari Wilson on the fast break, and let me tell you something, it is hard to believe how easy he makes this look because that, my friends, is not an easy layup. Here's Wilson again out front who finds Matt Heyman on the backdoor pass. Heyman caps it off with the slam and SFA finds themselves cruising along, leading by 17 at one point. Lumberjacks would maintain their lead and go on to win it 92 to 84 over Rio Grande Valley.